Big Cat, man. Boy, boy, boy. If y'all ain't feeling it in y'all veins, boy, golly. I think everybody knew he was going to be a, a dominant player in the league. Just his size. <laughs> Explosiveness. Fourth and three. <laughs> Leonard Williams got him. Just how phenomenal and athletic he was. Wrapped up by Leonard Williams. And I think he always played with that. He's kind of found his lane and just a dominant force. You talk about Big Cat. Uh, where did that nickname come from? It seems obvious. He's big, he's powerful, and a leader of the Giants defense. Yes, sir. Three, two, one, let's go! He could be the guy with strength and power or beat him with a quick swim move and be in the backfield disrupting and got a knack for getting to the quarterback as well. He slammed to the turf. Leonard Williams. You just see him working against Eric Flowers right there, just relentless in that power rush. Just keeps working, just powers through that. He silently molded himself into a well-rounded player. He's not silent on the field. He's been making noise the last two seasons on the top 100. You've gone from strictly interior to him being able to flex out. Lee Smith, he's doing all he can, but Leonard Williams is a big man. It's different when you have 300 plus pounds coming off that edge with a whole lot of power for an offensive tackle who's been dealing with the speed guy for a couple weeks. Big guys definitely know how to fold an offensive tackle. So yeah, I love that for him. Under pressure, gonna get sacked. Initial pressure from Leonard Williams. That's all good. <laughs> His ability to flex in, flex out, and just his ability to grow the last couple years has been pretty great. Stafford is going to get sacked, tipped by Leonard Williams. He plays the game the way it's supposed to be played, and he's excelling in a way that I think, you know, everybody knew he could. <laughs> <laughs> 